Hey there guys, so I'm about ready to pressurize the plumbing system in here and uh, before you ever do that, you should always have everything open to let the air out. So I'm turning on all the plumbing mechanisms here so that uh, I don't have an issue with the air pressure popping different lines and whatnot. Oh, day I break these chains I'm bound for the life of the simple things. Right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to hook up this pressure regulator uh, to the RV before I connect the water. You should always remember that you have to have one of these. Uh, the pressure that you get in the lines from city water is usually higher than your plumbing inside your RV is regulated for. So what this does is it reduces the pressure down so it's absolutely not going to be more than 40 pounds, which the water lines inside your RV should be able to handle. It's going to be the first time I tried to pressurize these lines. So, you know, cross our fingers. <laughs> Later, guys. Waiting on Catalina to get in the car and then we're headed over to uh, Walmart to pick up some supplies. Uh, to run water to the uh, RV and then uh, also to make some homemade black tank deodorizer. Hello YouTube, so Catalina and I are headed into Woodlands Pure Vegetarian Indian Cuisine here off of uh, OBT in Orlando, Florida. So they're supposed to have a pretty good buffet over here. Both Catalina and I really enjoy Indian food. so. We're gonna go and enjoy ourselves. some Indian food. Catalina loves some Indian food. So we're gonna enjoy some Indian food, right baby? Yeah. Did you like this food, James? It had a lot better. <laughs> yeah, I didn't like much. All right guys, so I have the garden hose hooked up here. I have everything turned on inside the coach. And now we're going to see if I'm going to pop some plumbing or not. Uh, the water pump and everything works, but I haven't pressurized anything yet. It seems okay so far. I got water running in. It's pretty good seal there. What? Yeah. What? How is it to drive Smitty? It's good, baby. You want me to go around the block? Right. That's the first drive. <gasps> I think things from the bathroom. That's going to be gross. Oh, it's better we don't go anywhere. Yeah. And empty the tanks first. Well, guys, we are going to empty the tanks first before something bad can occur. the coach now you go to the right and then straight the coach and go and back up yeah back up the other other side
here we guys are James trying to dump our tank. How is the work going? Having fun there? Real blast, guys. Already smells stinky and I haven't even opened the valve. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah. I gotta get something to prop the hose up. Yeah, that's not a really nice job, huh? Now we are trying to find the valve. <laughs> huh, baby? Yep. Trying to find the valve to open to dump it. And my luck, it's in that mud puddle over there. Lucky you, huh? <laughs> well, that's my luck today, anyways. Yeah, we couldn't first, we couldn't find as well the valve, huh? Secondly. Not the I just couldn't find the valve. It doesn't have the normal style of valve, but it also had fitting issues and everything else. <laughs> Let's see if we can have this done before it's dark, huh? Pretty much is. Already, huh? Yeah. Go pull the valve, baby, and listen for me to screech. Let me see if I can reach the valve. I got it. How is that, babe? The light is bright. <laughs> but the water is coming, huh? Finally. Thanks God, we're not gonna have like the bed smell tonight, huh? Well, we are. For a little while. Oh, we are gonna clean with the pine saw and everything? Well, the pine saw is because I'm gonna make this a uh, homemade uh, deodorizer because I don't like the chemicals that are in some of the other deodorizers. Mm -hmm. And uh, I know some stuff that's better on the environment that I can do with boring household ammonia and pine salt. Oh, but you're not gonna do it tonight? Well, I'm going to. We got... I have to. I don't really have a choice, baby. It wasn't that difficult, you know? Like, if we knew how the valve was small, right? Yeah. We couldn't find. Well, a lot of it's just learning. Learning our own coach, you know. Yeah, it was a journey for me today. Our Sunday, huh? Yeah. <laughs> nice weekend, right, baby? Yeah. Okay, nice so Sunday. I want to flush more water through that. I need you to take this in with you hmm. and uh, spray the bathroom floor, the shower floor. Okay. Be careful when you're doing it, you know. Alright. Ah, uh, James, good news? Yeah, baby, it looks like we're having a minor victory here. We got the tank flushing. You need to keep an eye on the tank in there, though, for me, baby. Here we have the water in the sink. Did it go in there? And the water in the bathroom. Yeah, well, you cannot show <laughs> much. Here. Doesn't seem like the plumbing's leaking at all, baby. I think the plumbing is probably pretty good. We got water running in it solid. We filled up the holding tank and we didn't have any leaks when it, when it was full. Um, just trying to flush it out a few times and then we'll check, uh, see how the uh, water tank, the storage tank's working. We'll pressurize it up and see about turning on the shower and stuff, you know. Yeah, but I think it's time for us to... Well, no, baby, we gotta get what we started done. Oh, one more victory today. It's been like a pretty stress Sunday day, but we got like the water in the sink from our tank. Jamie's filling out the, our tank over here. Huh, baby? Just trying to clean up the 
clean it out and everything. But we have water in the coach. Yeah. And in the tank. It's a minor victory, huh, baby? Woohoo! Congrats! I'm just glad that pipes aren't busted out. I'm just glad the pipes aren't busted out and spewing everywhere. Yeah, no leaks, huh? So far. That's pretty nice. Yeah. yeah. Where's wood? We need to knock on some wood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. Get out there, connect with people, live your big story. Make sure you do something every single day to reduce wood, sir. Peace, guys. Without you, my friend, can I tell you all about it when I see you again? We come a long way from where we've